okwu nta biire maka ukochuku a tongue twister about a reverend Ndee, well, this is Yvonne from Lenny Bonown Challenge. And in this video, we're going to learn how to use a tongue twister that has to do with a reverend. Um, like I said before, tongue twisters are really helpful when you're trying to learn pronunciation, when you're trying to learn how to become more, more verbal in a language. So it will help you get your, your mouth round the entry cases of the language is a kind of a workout in the language. So the one we're going to do today is a tongue twister about a reverend. Okunta bire maka okochuku. But the key words we will learn from this. The key words we will learn from this um, tongue, tongue twister are okochuku reverend or a clergyman or a pastor or a priest okuchuku sermon okuchuku sermon so chuku is god so ukochuku is the person that you know um, represents god or spreads god's word reverend so okuchuku is sermon and incidentally, the, the name of the reverend used in this tongue twister is Okechuku. Okechuku is an Igbo name that means God's share. Then Olo, house, Chuku, God. But generally, because in this tongue twister, we, um, we call church Olo Chuku, but in everyday life, church is usually known as Oloka. Olo Oka. But for the purposes of this tongue twister, it is Olo Chuku. So Olo is house, Chuku is God. So you won't actually see this Oloka in the tongue twister, but I just put it here so that you will know what the, the everyday name for church means. Ready? Let's begin. Can you be do? Uko chuku o ke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku dinaro chuku. Uko chuku o ke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku dinaro chuku. So there's a lot of chukus here. And um, designed to trip you up or get you to learn how to move your mouth around the words so it means reverend okechuku preached a sermon in the church at arochuku so kuru is usually said means said so iku is the verb to say but um when you're talking about preaching a sermon it's now kuro kuchuku so spoke about god's word that's what the literal meaning for this is so uko chuku o ke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku dinaro chuku. Aro chuku is a, a, um, a region in Igbo land around Abia state. A place called Aro chuku is in Abia state in um, old Imo axis. So we'll practice again. We'll say this thing five times. Uko chuku o ke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku dinaro chuku. Uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku denaro chuku. Uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku denaro chuku. Uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku denaro chuku. Uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku denaro chuku. Uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku denaro chuku. So it's a very good workout for your um speaking practice so the words we've encountered again in this tongue twister are ukochuku reverend okuchuku sermon god's word that's what the literal meaning is oku is word chuku is god so god's sermon is god's words is sermon ulo house chuku god 
and then uloka is what um church is regularly known as so when you hear when people are talking about church you will, you will not hear olochuku you will hear uloka okay we'll go through this again we'll go through the tongue twister again uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku di na ro chuku uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku di na ro chuku uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku di na ro chuku uko chuku oke chuku kuro ku chuku no lo chuku di na ro chuku so this um you might struggle a bit initially but practice makes perfect so the more you 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 talk about this the more you talk about it the more you get used to speaking speaking with this um, tongue twister that's it for now call messia see you soon